I got a condensing unit we're gonna scrap out today. Some good copper in here, insulated copper wire, number two copper pipe, some nice big brass fittings. Gonna be a radiator in here. It's either gonna be copper aluminum or aluminum aluminum. But this one looks like it's gonna be copper aluminum. There's a fan motor up there in the top. And then on the inside, there's a compressor, a motor. Let me start taking it apart. I'll show you as we go. Piece of aluminum. This wire goes up to the fan motor. Some nice brass down in here. All insulated copper wire. A couple screws here will just pop off. And then just a piece of light iron. Right here. Got to take all these screws out all the way around it. And I'll be able to get this cover off for you. copper in there and then all brass up on the top there a little capacitor insulated copper wire iron there's a couple screws right down here by 16 that'll free up these brass fittings for you this is a copper aluminum radiator goes all the way around the condensing unit and inside here is the compressor motor We'll cut the copper free. I'll make another video of these at a later date, but we'll cut all this off here. And then inside here, there's a nice heavy chunk of copper. There's the fan motor up there in the top. A couple screws up here on the top. We'll take this off. We'll get this cover off. A few screws all the way around. Under here, there's a bolt that holds the fan in. Then we get all this nice number two copper. Let me take it apart a little further. I'll get this wire grate off. I'll show it to you then. Nice, they're freed up now. This whole thing is loose.
Cut that piece of brass free. I'll cut this closer. couple of bolts down here, half inch bolts, four of them, we'll get this compressor motor off. Seven sixteenths bolt, we'll take this grate off of the fan here. Save this if you are looking for a nice grate, something to put, put this across a five gallon bucket. And then you can take that compressor motor, drill a couple holes in the bottom and rest it on here. The oil will all drain out and this is real nice and heavy. This isn't going to bend or break. You could put a few of them on top of it also if you put it across a bigger bucket. Nice to have it. And here's just a fan motor. Loosen up this one bolt. The blades will slide off. And then we'll have the motor to take apart at a later date. So this is what we got. Copper aluminum radiator. Fan. Electric fan motor. A little bit of screws. A brass fitting couple pieces of number two copper pipe and a brass fitting here we'll cut that free it's a pile of light iron that was the bottom and the top and the little side pieces that hold all the controls a little hunk of insulated copper wire that's got some brass in it and a coil of copper in the bottom and then another thing we're after is this big compressor motor. It's pretty heavy. I'll cut that apart another day and show you the copper we get out of there. And then there's just that top grate that's on the top. Protects you from the fan. Like I said, save that. Put that across a barrel. Five gallon bucket. Anything. And then you could put the compressor motor right on top of it, drill some holes in it, and let the oil drain right through it. Works real nice. So that's it. That's what you get out of a condensing unit. I'm going to keep going. Let's take apart some more of this other junk in here. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, share it with your friends. We'll see you on the next one.